for many Americans, especially military families and service members here in San Diego. Memorial Day weekend is a somber time to remember and honor those who died while serving our country. Fox 5's Tony Shin is live at Fort Rosecrans National Cemetery with more. Tony. Yeah, Kathleen, you said it. As you and I both know, Memorial Day is such an important part of our country to remember these fallen heroes. And here at Fort Rosecrans, all day long, we have seen workers out here busy getting this place ready for Memorial Day, like putting up these beautiful American flags. They are signs of respect for the heroes who sacrificed their lives for our freedom. It is a heartbreaking day at Fort Rosecrans National Cemetery for family members who are laying to rest. Jose Mariano Borja, a Navy veteran who lived to the age of 96 and recently passed away. We do have a great deal of pride. And for family members, there is also a tremendous amount of pride for this man. My father was Sergeant Rudolph Nunez, and he was a Special Forces uh, Long Range Reconnaissance Patrol. Airborne Ranger person, and uh, he was killed in action on 13 June 1966. Today, Army veteran Eric Nunez is burying his uncle, but when he was only four years old, he was mourning the tragic death of his father, Rudolph, an American hero who gave his life for our country in Vietnam while leaving behind a wife and three small children. Here is a picture of Eric as a child on the day he was handed his father's Purple Heart. How impactful has that been on your life, not having your dad around? I think in a lot of ways, it, it's the thing that formed uh, who I am today. And I think always having his medals around and, and his accomplishments um, made me aware of what he sacrificed. So you can imagine why Memorial Day is so important for Eric and his family. It is meant uh, to memorialize those who gave their life in the service of their country and protecting uh, the United States and everything uh, that it cares for. And you know, I think that uh, self selfless sacrifice uh, really is what it what it's about. Which is why this family is hoping this weekend everyone will enjoy their time with family and friends while also remembering the reason Monday is dedicated to honoring our fallen heroes. Well, I think this is one of the things that's uh, probably lacking a little bit in our country today is to understand the cost of freedom and, and how important that price is to pay. We should honor those people that have actually stood up and uh, are willing to pay that price for our freedoms. Now that special ceremony here at Fort Rosecrans National Cemetery begins at 10 a.m. If you do plan on coming up, which I hope you do, it's a wonderful, beautiful event. Uh, you might want to get here around 9 o'clock in the morning uh, to really avoid all that traffic. There's going to be parking issues. You probably are going to also have to take a shuttle bus. That's the latest from here. Reporting live in Point Loma, I'm Tony Shin, Fox 5 News. All right, from hallowed ground. Thank you so much, our Tony Shin.